Tires.com, and I want to give a special shout out to uh, Cottonelle Tires. We uh, just got back from our third session, right? Third session on the uh, slicks. First time riding on slicks. Uh, I don't know why I'm a little bit intimidated by it, but uh, it was really interesting to hear some of the advice from the friends in our pit here where they just said, uh, just trust them. Uh, they're on tire warmers, have the tire pressure set, what uh, Monkey Work Cycle and Daytona had suggested. Uh, I see no reason to change that. Um, unbelievable confidence. Like, I, I can't, uh, I really didn't think it would feel that different. I thought that it would maybe just have more grip on leaning or whatever, but it's just a completely different feel. It's like when you enter into the corner, it, the entire way, it's nothing but confidence. So, uh, man, I've been bragging up those uh, street cotties because they're great. Did, uh, I think, three sessions this morning again on those, which puts those at, those are two to Full two days really a track case and they aren't even more. But uh, check out these tires here and see how they're wearing. Uh, I have to say that another big part of the success of this is also the suspension. So Dan Kyle Racing, can't thank you enough. Uh, I just don't feel I need to do a thing. I'm not at a level, I'm, I'm riding the bike, I'm learning the track. The first session here in Indy this morning is damn near terrifying. It's an intense track, it's super, uh, mentally exhausting. There's a lot happening, but uh, look at this wear. And uh, Eric over there had us 24 in the rear, 32 in the front, and uh, I mean they're just they're just wearing perfect. So I think we're uh, even on the left side here. We're using all the tire on both sides. Left turns here took a while to get used to too. There's a decreasing radius one that really. Uh, has been a workout for me. We got a bunch of cool footage. We got the 360 camera. We did a couple on bike uh, shots to watch everything work. Let's check out how the front looks because uh, some of our uh, fans right here might have some feedback. Eric and uh, uh, Kyle might have some feedback too. But look at the wear on that. I mean, I blew my O ring off this side. Come around, come around this side so you can see how much I'm using. Man, like freaking perfect. Uh, I know I stabbed the brakes on the other side. Blew a little oil, blew the O-ring, but this is working good. Uh, man, I am super, super, like, I'm on such a high. Just can't thank the people enough for being part of this weight loss journey, uh, getting us back on the track. Um, all these folks here. Hey, guys, say hi. Wait for the camera. These are the new friends. Uh, thanks for the invite. Uh, man, it has been super awesome to uh, to get back out here. We're uh, they going to Legoland. Yeah, it is freaking hot, right? What did we get up to for Tim? One forty-seven. Uh, no, I mean just uh, ambient Tim. Ninety-nine. Ninety-nine. Boy, it seems way hotter than that. <laughs> Supposed to be one hundred and ten. No complaints, uh, Chris Parrish, for putting on this event, too. He's been nothing but awesome to uh, to be us and get to know. But we're going to head to lunch break. I'm going to debate whether I do another session or two. I ain't going to lie, I'm whooped. Uh, this is quite a workout. So, anyway, everybody, make sure to hit up our sponsors. Oh, you know another person I want to give a shout-out to? It's uh, uh, E-Torque Torque Wrenches. Uh, use these, changing the tires, uh, checking the bike out, getting them over again. Uh, as always, performed awesome. Uh, who else am I forgetting? Uh, lithium LM2 on the leathers, fit like a glove, freaking super awesome. I'll make some more videos, I'll make sure I think of everybody, but I need to get some food and water in me. So, make it a great day. Hit that like, subscribe, share button, and as always, keep wrenching.